Grimes, a 35-year-old Canadian musician, has captivated the internet with her recent interview in Wired. In a fascinating, jaw-dropping revelation, the singer expressed her desire to die in space. Sounds surreal, right? Well, let's dive into her cosmic aspirations. According to Grimes, Earth is just the starting point, the real adventure lies in the cosmos. I would like to go far enough out there to where my body could not handle coming back, she said. It's like graduating from tricycles to mountain bikes, but on a cosmic scale. Grimes doesn't just want to float aimlessly in space, she has a destination in mind. Mars. Why Mars? It's almost like Earth's mischievous twin, offering a tantalizing promise of a new world. Grimes is intrigued by the idea of megastructures in space, grand engineering marvels. She hopes to see one, up close and personal, before her last breath. Imagine the Eiffel Tower but in zero gravity. Grimes acknowledges her responsibilities as a mother. If her children need her, especially if grandchildren come into the picture, she might reconsider her plans. Parenthood it's the ultimate anchor, isn't it? Grimes believes that if she dies on Earth, she might regret not exploring other worlds. It's like looking back and realizing you never left your hometown. On the other hand, dying in space would give her a sense of fulfillment. Grimes and Elon Musk, the SpaceX founder, have a storied history. They started dating in 2018 and broke up in 2022. The duo has two children together, which might add some complexities to her spacefaring ambitions. In the Wired interview, Grimes praised Elon's leadership and SpaceX's accomplishments. It's like being at the forefront of a revolution, watching the very scaffolding of the future being built. Thanks to her connection with Elon, Grimes could have a head start in making her cosmic dreams a reality. It's like having a VIP pass to the universe. Many fans are intrigued by her vision, discussing the possibilities and ramifications on social media. Of course, not everyone is on board. Some find the idea indulgent or impractical, especially given the global challenges we face on Earth. It raises existential questions about our place in the universe. Dying in space is not all sci-fi and grandeur, there are stark realities to consider. Grimes thinks 65 might be a good age for her space journey to begin and end. It's an interesting choice, as 65 is often considered the age of retirement on Earth. Age can influence one's ability to withstand the rigors of space travel. It's not as simple as booking a ticket and taking off. From cosmic radiation to the absence of medical facilities, the risks are enormous. As of now, science doesn't fully support the idea of living and dying on another planet. But who knows what the future holds. Before Grimes can realize her dream, there are massive technological challenges to overcome. How does one prepare emotionally and psychologically for such a journey? It's uncharted territory in many ways. Grimes is not alone. Other celebrities, like Jeff Bezos and Richard Branson, have shown interest in space travel, albeit for different reasons. Grimes' wish to die in space is both captivating and bewildering. Whether feasible or not, her dream opens up dialogues on various fronts, from philosophy to science, challenging our conventional thoughts about life and death. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Leave your comments and put your likes under the video.